bananas are so unripe. I can't make oatmeal today because I have to have bananas in my oatmeal. So I'm gonna make a smoothie. I always start with baby spinach. I have bananas that I froze from a few days ago. And I am going to put in a little bit of um, plant-based yogurt. I have lecture in literally two minutes, so I'm gonna be really quick. Um, all of my, well, two of my lectures today are online, and then tomorrow my lectures are gonna be in person. Um, I have seven hours of lectures tomorrow, which is so lovely. Um, but anyways, I just filled out my planner spread, and you can see the evidence of using my fountain pen. I didn't wipe it off well enough when I was um, refilling it, so that is why. When we call the function, we're passing in whatever it is. I find produce to be just so beautiful and one day, I'm gonna start a garden when I settle down somewhere. First up, I have these rosemary baguette things, and I plan on making uh, pumpkin soup later this week, so um, I wanna dip those in there. And then I got, as my snack of choice, some cloud things. I got three gala apples, some Brussels sprouts. I love roasting Brussels sprouts. Um, three avocados. I got three of these large clementines. I could probably eat all three if it was socially acceptable. Uh, and then I got two of these gorgeous heirloom tomatoes. Look at how beautiful they are. I just, I don't know, I can't stop admiring heirloom tomatoes. I got three Yukon gold potatoes because I Everyone knows I'm a big fan of potatoes. And then I got this organic apple cinnamon cereal, which this looks like granola to me. So I'm just gonna use it as granola. Um, I've never seen cereal that's just like that. And then I just got some cute little mushrooms. I find mushrooms to be really adorable too. I'm just eating the cloud puff things that I bought earlier, which is really, really good. And I'm doing some readings for um, health economics, just writing down some notes. Um, I thought I would show you guys um, how I structure my readings. I use Notion for a lot of stuff, um, as you can see. If you want to see a more in-depth video, definitely let me know. Um, but for example, one of the things that I do for school is when I have readings, um, I first of all put down the link for easy access and then I start off a vocabulary list of all of the vocabulary that I don't know and I had to search up. Um, and then I have two columns. The wider column is for relevant information that um, I think might appear on a quiz or um, might be useful for a future paper that I have to write. And then interesting stuff is just anything that I personally find interesting but might not be really useful for anything. Map 223, right? Where if I compare the x squared part, I know that this has to be a 2. Good morning. Um, today is another rainy day, which I love. Um, I have a very busy day of lectures. I have my first 9 a.m. in about an hour and a half. Um, so I can still get some things done. Investment 
I just got back from meeting my friend. Um, I haven't seen her for several months because of summer break, so it was really nice. I have about 30 minutes before my next lecture um, in which I have a group presentation, which is so lovely. I prefer that you keep your camera on, but if your internet does not allow it, I am now back home. Uh, I had a very long day. I have sushi on the way, which I'm really excited about. I typically don't allow myself to order takeout um, just because I already meal prep everything. But um, I am going to have a video chat date with my sister. Uh, we haven't caught up in several weeks, so we both order takeout and we're just gonna enjoy some food together and chat about life. Okay, my food arrived, which I'm so happy about, but I have to be really quick because my sister got her food 10 minutes ago and she will kill me if I spend too long. Anyways, I got a salmon avocado roll and six pieces of salmon sashimi and I'm so, 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 so excited. Okay, I have to call my sister now. Good morning. If you're wondering, wow, Helen looks really disheveled, <laughs> you would be absolutely correct. I slept at uh, 4 yesterday for the morning and uh, I, I don't know, my body just naturally woke up at 6 and I mistook the number 6 for 9 and I have lecture today at 9 so I just had a mini freak out and started like frantically getting ready for lecture um thinking that i was late but um it was just my brain being weird so this is uh, very evident to me that i am not in a very good state so today is going to be just like a reset day uh, number one i will not be consuming coffee today uh, number two following with that um, i will be consuming eight cups of water or um, four full mugs of water um, I already finished my first one this morning. Number three, I I will be I was supposed to go to the gym before lecture, but um, I was just so tired and I couldn't go. So I will be going to the gym this afternoon at around 3 p.m. Number four, I am going to clean up my workspace a little bit. And number five, I'm going to sleep at a reasonable hour today. I'm going to stay in my PJs for now, but um, later on I will change into normal clothes. Good afternoon. I have to admit, I accidentally <laughs> made a cup of coffee out of habit. I'm currently working on my paper for health economics. I do want to show you. Um, I started Inktober this week and I did really well for the first three days. Um, it was crystal, suit, and vessel. However, <laughs> it is uh, October 6th and I have not done anything for day four, five, and six. So I'm probably going to do that all in one go, but isn't it so cute? I love the fish with the suit. Anyways, I am going to continue working on my paper and then I have to go to the gym in an hour and 10 minutes, which I'm so excited about. To measure that, but then to say like, actually we can just give it a numerical score and maybe it really is different,
I got some groceries on the way back. These are little plume cuts or plum cuts. I think they're plume cuts. I got three regular red plums. I really love plums and peaches. Four apples, romaine lettuce for salads, and also this bread. I got through a lot of my emails this morning and I finished one paragraph of my uh, economics paper. Later this afternoon, I plan to make a post in the Facebook group and also on Instagram showcasing the new um, samplers and what else? I have a new Archer and Olive hula I believe they had um, production issues or something, which is totally fine. They were super kind and agreed to change my address. Um, and this is the plant, plant-based bride collaboration in the olive green color and it is so so beautiful absolutely adore this notebook hello uh it's been a few hours and i'm still writing my paper as a little progress update i let's see i would say i have three and a half paragraphs done which is pretty good. Anyways, in about 30 minutes, I will be going to the gym again. My planner is still relatively empty. Actually, I haven't done anything since this morning, but uh, I will fill it out in a little bit. The taste of this is so bad. <laughs> so I just chug it in two gulps. Number four, mm -hmm. um, I just don't really get what this means by like, five doesn't have a, Okay, so how did you solve right now? What happens to the face inspector? In particular, I want to draw a ceiling fan. I've never drawn a ceiling fan before and I'm not confident that I will be able to get it right. So I'm gonna cheat a little bit and use a pencil. Uh, how about an emoji flying off the fan? A little gruesome, but that's okay. okay. So it's Inktober. I must use some sort of black pen. I could just use my Muji, Muji pen. Or I can use my, I'll use my Tombow. Or maybe a mix of both. I don't know. I'm a mess today. My brain is still thinking about um, health economics. And again, this is really rough. I'm not really fussy about it. Um, I know, like Inktober, for a lot of a lot of people, it's a big thing where like each day is a masterpiece. And one day, I would love to do that. But uh, I know at this moment, I would not be able to keep up. I'm really excited to finish this sketchbook eventually because I really want to do a flip through of all of the sketches that I have done. It is quite a bit. Um, but this book is really thick, so it'll definitely take me a while. And fun fact, my sister got this book for me when I was still in high school, so it's been, I would say, at least five to six years I've had this uh, sketchbook. And only now have I decided to actively start using it. For my previous days, I was super quick about it, but this one, I will spend some time perfecting, I guess. I'm gonna shade in all of the blades. I think this actually looks like a ceiling blade, or ceiling blade, ceiling fan, which is pretty cool. And I know this is strange, but I'm just gonna draw some arrows. I think it adds a cool look. This is day seven. I'm gonna continue working on my paper now. Good morning. It is actually 3.55 a.m. Uh, I slept earlier, hence the messy background, but I don't know, I'm awake again. I really just could not sleep, so I wrote like three sentences of my paper. Uh, and now I'm sleepy again, which is awesome. And I also remembered I didn't finish my planner spread for today. So I want to fill it out before I 
go to sleep a second time. Okay, I'm gonna use a thinner one. And just a little bit. Maybe I should add some fun, fun decorations. I'm gonna put this little dude and, and uh, ooh, I have a little cloud. Please don't judge me. I know it's, it's not even the middle of the night. It's almost morning and uh, I'm playing with stickers in my planner, but um, This is what makes me happy, so <laughs> it's all good. It's so adorable. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna fill out. Did you hear my stomach grumble? Um, I'm gonna fill this out tomorrow morning, but. Or I guess today morning. Today morning? This morning. Oh, okay, I need to get to bed. This is my Inktober drawing for today, and the prompt is watch, and um, I actually really like how this turned out, so I don't know if you can tell, but this is a... Okay, my watch is a little off-center, but it's a model of my own hand, and I just drew a bunch of eyes around it because they're like watching. It's a list object, as well as the six integers 0, 2, 4, 6, 8, and 10. Good evening. Um, we are probably near the end of this video. I just wanted to, I guess, reflect on this week a little bit in case you happen to make it this far. As I likely have shown in this video, nothing too spectacular happened this week, but I, I'm very content and I'm in a good mood. Um, not really sure why. I know that in the past few videos, I it's very apparent that I have mental- I deal with mental health issues and um, I just had a really good week this week and I appreciate all of your kind comments and um, reassurance. I really do hope you had a wonderful week and a lovely week ahead. So, bye everyone! <laughs>